Hello everyone. Um, just to give you an update on the situation. Um, that update that it's downloading is trying to remove beta from everyone. Um, they are, Tesla is doing this wrong uh, and right at the same time. The problem is I was in the original beta group but I don't want to lose beta after using beta for almost a year like nine like 11 months I'm so used to using it I can't even drive correctly without it now to be honest um, it's such a life hack it really is even though with the issues it does have it's so it's such an incredible change I'm like I'm probably always gonna be buying full self driving on any car going forward but yeah there um this update right here I didn't realize is a public build. Uh, 36.5.1 is a public build without beta. And so, yeah, it's, they're just trying to downgrade everyone. Everyone's downloading this update. Uh, a few people are not downloading it for some reason. But um, they're trying to download that update and get everyone off beta because Twitter is having a field day, um, from what I can see, and everything else. Uh, having tons of issues with this update. What they should have done, in my... Well, that's not right. Okay, let's go lower the speed down. No one behind me. Braked hard there. What they should have done... Now let's get past this turn first. Okay, so this is good. Oh, they're gonna mess up again. Oh, yay! <laughs> it, it did it right. That was perfect. Yeah, that, that was the first update ever to do that right. So, it got that going for us. Not all bad. Not all bad. And it's stopping for the stop sign, too. Yeah. Um, not the first update to do that, but like the last three, of, like only one other update actually stopped for the stop sign. I'm not sure why it's stopping right there. It's overly cautious now. Okay, so that's awesome. Um, put my sunglasses back on. Make sure also. Okay, sorry, I was making sure I was recording properly. Oh, big pothole right there. Um, I'm gonna keep on going this slower speed to be safe right here. No, that's that's good. Also, it's staying a little bit further from the right. This is good. It's odd. It's like it's like. I didn't go and park again. I was in um, a hill hold the entire time. Yeah, this is good. This. The car behind me is getting a little bit. Um, I'm okay. I'm trying not to go over that. A hole in the ground right there. Again, I did that last time. I don't want to do that again. <laughs> um, first time it's done that. Obviously, I'm not driving on the right side of the road. Okay. So what we need to do here is go around through this parking lot. I'm gonna get it started going this way I want it to go through this parking lot every time if I can if I can make it the actual speed limit is 10 mile an hour in this parking lot not 25 I wish to just the map finish I wish it was just the base level of the maps were accurate and then I obviously they're gonna change over time and obviously update should happen but you know it's, it's gonna have to go based on previous information and eventually what's going to happen is the car is going to read the signs and then learn what the speed limits are in an area and it'll eventually automatically adjust based on what it's seeing. Okay, I was I was wrong, it was 15 mile an hour. Um, I don't know, what, I guess I was thinking 10 for some reason. But um, yeah, and this car, see this is a case where the car is stopping. My car is doing the, the right thing and going around it. go they re navigate us here
I mean, to be honest, 10.2, or sorry, 10.3, this Going is the... To the right onto Patton Avenue. This is the best this has ever been. Um, I think. I mean, just because it fixed those two issues. Okay, we're good to go. It's go I'm pressing it to go. Go ahead and go. We actually do need to get in this left lane here, so I'm gonna go ahead and... Go ahead and get in the correct lane. I'm actually surprised. I was gonna say, I'm surprised how quick it's going around this corner. Um, actually, hold on. Yeah, sorry, this is the correct lane. <laughs> it's turning on the right blinker to make a left merge. <laughs> Gotta be careful right here. Again, there's been some odd issues with automatic emergency braking with this version. And um, they obviously are pulling it back, but it's big enough to like make a fleet wide update. Um, personally, I'm not, unless they force me to, I'm not getting rid of beta. I would much rather downgrade the 10.2 what they did, they they're doing it wrong. They just did a re just reverse everyone back to the update, force everyone back to the previous update they had, and be done with it. Instead of downloading this new update, uh, forcing everyone to have that, that's that's not the correct choice in my opinion. It was a rash, quick decision, and they should have just downgraded their, what everyone had. I had 10.2. I should go back to 10.2, and I would be fine with that until they work out the bugs and go download the new version again. Okay, we're actually good to go. Okay. So the one time it doesn't want to go around... Okay. One time it doesn't want to go around traffic in the road. Let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, that situation, I'm going to have to review that closer. I probably might put some text up on the screen or something. I'm not sure, but that situation was really odd. You had car stopped on the road. You got this car um, that... Uh, had to go out and they went out and then people started crossing the road for some reason without paying attention for oncoming traffic and yeah that was an odd situation um of course it went over the pothole again that i would not have suspected any update so far to have have done correctly it's just, uh, it, that's just, I, I just don't expect Beta to have done that situation correctly. Obviously, I don't really think I did it correctly either. Obviously, I've recovered from it. Because um, I was going to go in front of that car, then I saw the people crossing the road. I'm like, why are the people crossing the road when this car was going? And what happened is the people went out in the road, uh, and they went out in traffic. And so just hope traffic would stop for them. Which people, at least in the state of North Carolina, the humans always have the right of way. Uh, if you cross in the middle of a busy street, people have to stop for you. It was stupid as that is. Uh, you walk down the road, traffic has to be expected to stop for you. I find that to be so stupid. Navigate to the Asheville outlets. Not sure why I kept on accelerating towards that car. These critiques might be somewhat unfair because obviously this version's getting pulled. I'm still gonna release all the videos. 
there ain't no NDA on on anyone to release videos like this. I'm not trying to put Tesla in a bad light. I'm just trying to be transparent. That's the way I want to be. I'm going to give the full situation of what's happening. If this update was good, update bad, I'm going to give it out. Um, so far, this update seems to be better on curves. Uh, that's just a few minor improvements. I, obviously, I still think 10.2 is better. And... In 500 feet, Garrett might to stay on Gregard Rose. Oh, come on. Stop turning on the blinker. NV... Oh, whoa, no way. That's an electric... Is it NV200? I've never seen one of those in, per, in person. I've seen it's all on Bajoran's channel. That's an electric vehicle in front of us. Never thought I'd see one of those here, to be honest. Press the accelerator to get it to go through more confidently. Yeah, again, it does seem to be improved going around curves. Uh, I, I do like that a lot. I'm not sure about this. It's, it slowed well. Uh, it seemed to be a little bit better. It's hard to hard to tell for sure. So that lane change was too early in my opinion and should do it past the interstate but it's it's fine as long as it stays in this lane i'm gonna press the accelerator here i think these little temporary lines weren't here last time uh, i think that might be new this construction starting to finish up we're gonna see if it tries to get in the wrong lane again i'm gonna try and stop it does it stay in this lane Yeah, see, it's trying to get over. That's it. This is the on-ramp to the highway, right here. Yeah. Okay. It turned the right blinker on. It said turn left and turn the right blinker on. Well, we're going way, 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 way too fast here. That was that was honestly not a good update at all. Um, well, sorry, not, not a good um, end to this drive. The beginning part of the drive was pretty dang well. The end of this drive, I, it just seemed like I was coming in way too hot. Like, it just stopped seeing cars in front for some reason. I, I don't know. Okay, let's make sure it continues going left here. It tried to go right last time. Push it through. Okay, that seems to be a slight improvement. I'm having to give it more confidence though, so. Like it just, it's not, it's just wanting to stop. In 500 feet, your destination will be on the right. So we don't need to actually use the supercharger, but um, we all kind of just kind of go through here and regroup. That drive is okay. Uh, the first half of the drive obviously better than um, any other drives. Never done those turns before, and that stop sign is good. But um, I'm just gonna kind of review some notes here, and then we'll do our last drive to get back home, and we'll call it from there. I appreciate everyone watching. Uh, please let me know if you have any questions or any comments, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.